everyone and welcome to 10 foods that are bad for dogs. It is likely that you would like to give your dog access to all of your tasty meals. Who can resist those beggarly puppy eyes, after all, as they ask for a morsel? But resist the urge to indulge your pet. Knowing when to say, no, can be an important part of being a successful dog parent. Certain foods are simply plain unhealthy for dogs and can lead to a variety of health issues. Even though your dog has consumed these foods in the past without any complications, you might not be aware of the serious consequences they are causing. No matter how cutesy they beg for, you should never feed your dog these things. Bad foods that dog parents should keep away from their pups. Number 10. Chocolate. The food that you've undoubtedly heard about the most is at the top of the list of foods that are unhealthy for dogs, chocolate. Dogs can be poisoned by theobromine, while people are not affected by it. All varieties of chocolate include it, although dark and baking chocolates contain it the most. It may result in diarrhea, vomiting, and extreme thirst. On the severe end of the spectrum, it can result in mortality, tremors, seizures, and irregular cardiac rhythms. Keep the candies to yourself. Number 9. Bacon and Fatty Meat Wait, bacon is off limits for your dog. Yes, it is correct. Dogs that consume high-fat diets like bacon, ham, or pork trimmings may get pancreatitis. Additionally, because these meats frequently have a high salt content, they may irritate stomachs or, in the worst case scenario, encourage dogs to drink excessive amounts of water, which can result in bloat, which can be fatal. For your dog, choose leaner options and save the fatty meats for yourself. Number 8. Salty Foods You may have heard that popcorn and pretzels are bad for dogs, but that's usually only the case if those foods are salted. Salt can cause a condition called sodium ion poisoning, not to mention excessive thirst or urination. Symptoms of eating too much salt might include vomiting, diarrhea, high body temperature, and seizures. These are all in addition to bloat, as is the case with bacon. Salt can be fatal, so keep it to a minimum in the foods you share with your pup. Number 7. Garlic and Onions Not only does this one-two punch of foods ward off vampires and grant you dragon breath. For dogs, these strong substances are not good. If taken in large enough numbers, they can actually cause a dog's red blood cells to be destroyed, which results in anemia. This one is tricky because you might not get much harm from a modest dose. However, poisoning may result from a high dose or from repeated little doses. Weakness, vomiting, dyspnea, and a decrease in appetite are possible symptoms. Number 6. Milk, cheese, ice cream, and other dairy products. Although it's possible that you gave your dog a medication hidden in a piece of cheese, canines aren't actually made to digest items made from cow milk. While some dogs can tolerate dairy better than others, many dogs are lactose intolerant because they lack the enzyme needed to break down milk sugar. Dogs who consume dairy may get diarrhea, vomiting, or gastrointestinal disorders. Like with fatty meats, the excessive fat content might cause pancreatitis. Keep your dog away from the dairy. You get more ice cream. Number 5. Raw meat, fish, and eggs. There is debate on this one. When patients move to raw beef diets, many veterinarians observe improved health outcomes for their patients, such as simpler digestion, cleaner teeth, and healthier skin and coats. To remove potentially dangerous bacteria and parasites from raw food, some veterinarians advise heating it. Dogs can get salmonella and E. coli illnesses, and most veterinarians and the FDA still advise against giving them raw meat. Dogs with weakened immune systems are more likely to contract these infections, but it can be challenging to determine whether your dog is immune system healthy. Raw seafood can harbor parasites that cause deadly illnesses, and raw eggs contain enzymes that can cause skin issues in dogs. Before deciding to pursue a raw diet, you should consider the risks versus the advantages. By freezing and preparing food correctly, you can lower these hazards, but before feeding raw food to your dog, you must become knowledgeable about handling it safely. 
The most crucial thing to realize is that throwing raw meat into your dog's bowl after rushing to the grocery store is not safe at all. Similarly, do not let your dog steal raw meat from the trash or off the counter. To reduce the risk of bacterial or parasite infection, you should educate yourself on food preparation if you intend to transition your dog to a raw diet. Number 4. Candy, gum, peanut butter, and baked goods. When it comes to these candies, xylitol is actually the cause. It sends a surge of insulin through your dog's body, which can induce liver failure and a dip in blood sugar. Lethargy, vomiting, dizziness, convulsions, and finally death are among the symptoms. Before giving your dog any of these foods, especially peanut butter, make sure to review the ingredient list because some of them may not always include xylitol. Number 3. Grapes and Raisins It appears that your dog has consumed some grapes or raisins without any problems, so this is a covert instance of harmful foods. However, it's dangerous. It is known that raisins and grapes can induce renal failure in dogs. The kidneys of your dog may begin to fail, resulting in vomiting, fatigue, and sometimes even death. It is advisable to keep raisins and grapes out of your dog's reach. Number 2. Sugary Food Dogs shouldn't eat sugary food, humans shouldn't either. As with people, in fact, it can cause canines to have comparable issues. Overindulging in high sugar foods can lead to diabetes, obesity, and oral health problems. Give your dog no sugar. Number 1. Avocado Persin, which avocados contain in its leaves, seeds, bark, and fruit, is a major topic of debate when it comes to avocados and dogs. At excessive dosages, persin can be harmful. To be harmful, Persin would need to ingest a large number of avocados, but dogs are generally resistant to it. Avocados lose some of its persin after they reach ripeness. What, then, is the issue with avocados? Your dog might overindulge in unripe fruit and persin if you have an avocado plant on your home or yard. However, the tough-to-digest seeds, stems, and pits pose the actual threat. This may result in life-threatening gastrointestinal obstructions or choking. Make sure your dog cannot access your avocado tree or the fruit that drops to the ground if you have one. Use ripe avocados and remove any dangerous portions, such as the pits, before giving them to your dog. If so, your dog can probably eat avocados without risk. As usual, consult your veterinarian before giving your dog human food. Other things dogs should never eat. Other products that aren't necessarily food for you that your dog should stay away from include Uncooked yeast dough Seeds and pits from fruit Raw potato Cooked bones Apple cores Alcohol Caffeine Human medicine Don't let your dog anywhere near these products, as they are toxic and can lead to potential poisoning, choking, gastrointestinal issues, and death. Stick to a diet approved by your vet, or research some healthy foods that you can share with your dog. Resist that cute face and keep most of your human food to yourself. That's the 10 foods that are bad for dogs. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn on the bell for future notifications. And if you want to become a member then hit that join button to get some awesome emotes, perks, and much more coming soon. See you guys next time.